the earning potential of running a Theta Edge node on your computer just got better. Okay, let's go back in time to about 1960 and explain something. Uh, back in the day, way before the personal computer was invented, there were just big mainframe computers at universities. And so anybody that needed some computer processing power to run a program for research purposes or what have you, they had to essentially rent time on one of these big mainframe computers to do whatever it is that they needed a computer to figure out for them. Fast forward to the invention of the personal computer that enabled people to actually purchase their own computer to do different tasks that they needed to do. And then after that uh, at some point SETI came up with a program called SETI at home and essentially what that did was you could download that software to your computer and it would sit there and run in the background and it would take chunks of data from the SETI project transmitted to it it would process that uh, data and then send the results of it back to SETI and then SETI would send it the next chunk of data to be processed and so that was known as distributed computing so in 2000 there's a uh, project that runs similarly called folding at home and it was a distributed computing application that ran research uh, projects for the medical industry to figure out different things and that program has been out there since about 2000. Now let's talk a little bit about the edge node. The edge node was uh, a creation of Theta Labs and essentially what that does is it sits there in the background waiting for tasking and the tasking that it was designed to handle was to assist in uh, distributing video content and essentially what it does is let's say somebody wants to watch a video on YouTube and so that video is sent from YouTube to your computer well maybe you're 10 minutes into it and someone close to you requests to watch that same video instead of YouTube having to send that same video to them uh, your computer is tasked to relay pieces of that video uh, as needed in real time to uh, your neighbor that is, you know, maybe a couple of miles down the road. So that was the initial intended function of the edge node. Well, the reality is that unless you happen to be located in a densely populated area like one of the big cities you're in a smaller area such as I am and so there is a lot less work for that edge node to do as far as relaying video to people somewhat close to you so Theta Labs came up with the idea of they essentially had this army of computers at their uh, disposal that they can look for other things to have that edge node do that can earn you Theta fuel for doing it so they have partnered with this folding at home project to integrate that into the theta edge node so like in my case the theta edge node was sitting idle probably 22 hours 23 hours out of a 24 hour period and you're only earning while it's actually doing something relaying video in the original use case of it well now they can task your computer to process data for the folding at home project and you can earn T-Fuel that way as well. So now somebody who maybe their edge node was sitting idle for that 23 hours a day, they can now be processing data for the folding at home project and be earning T-Fuel 24 hours a day instead of just one hour out of the 24. Uh, if that makes sense. So that's a pretty exciting uh, expansion of what the edge node can do for you as far as your earning potential by running an edge node.
Oh, and by the way, they don't just force that on you. They're uh, on the edge node. You can opt out of running that uh, if you want to by simply turning it off. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're not already subscribed, please click the subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you won't miss any future videos. And thank you for watching.